Biden's family was getting money from Russia and a, a Russia-friendly company in Ukraine, Burisma, and the media is protecting him completely on it. Before I go, don't forget Joe Biden's role in all this. He's no innocent babe in the woods on this. He was vice president. He was in key briefings. And of course, he had corruption issues related to Russia and Ukraine and China, and everyone knew about that as well. Remember, Trump was impeached for blowing the whistle and trying to figure out what Biden was up to in terms of Ukraine corruption and the resulting attack on him out of Ukraine to help Hillary. What a, what a tangled web we, we weave, right? Talk about a conspiracy. There was a conspiracy and it was against Trump. And now potentially we're facing the worst security crisis in 60 years with Russia because in my view, Biden's been constrained and compromised by his corruption issues related to Russia and Ukraine. You think Putin doesn't, isn't aware that, that he has Biden potentially compromised and that hasn't incentivized him to take these steps that he's taking against Ukraine? Of course it has. I mean, if Trump were president and Russia was doing this, you'd still have the media, even though they know it was a lie, trying to tie him to Russia. Here we got information that Trump, uh, Biden's family was getting money from Russia and a, a Russia-friendly company in Ukraine, Burisma, and the media is protecting him completely on it. And I don't care what the media says and we're, we're not, you know, it's pretending what we're not allowed to talk about. I'm going to talk about it. And I believe that Biden's corruption is endangering our national security and destabilizing Europe as a result. So pray for peace. But let's, let's keep our eyes clear about what's really going on here. Thanks for tuning in. Be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel to catch all the latest news from Judicial Watch.